Mortgage Mark here. Let's talk about mortgage servicers. So guys, a mortgage servicer is the company that you actually make your mortgage payments to. So it may not be the company that originated your loan. It may not be a company that even originates loans at all. They may just be exclusively in the business to service mortgages. They are not necessarily the company that owns your mortgage. So a good example, I help you, we close a loan, we high five, we've seen Kumbaya, your loan, even if we keep it and we become your mortgage servicer, we may not necessarily be the owner of the mortgage. We may sell that mortgage to Fannie Mae, may sell it to Freddie Mac, may sell it to some you know, investor over here that you've never heard of, but we will be the face in this instance as a mortgage servicer, we will be the face of you. So in other words, when you have questions, we're gonna be the ones collecting your payment. There is a chance with all mortgage companies, big and small, that if we service the mortgage, we may sell your loan. Uh, we may close your loan and we may not even have it for longer than 30 days and we may sell your loan. Reason why guys, it th it's like, a, I mean, it's it, servicing, mortgage servicing has its own value and if mortgage companies can make some money, that's how they keep the lights on. You know, to, to make money long term as a servicer, you get a little bit of money each month. So long term, it's great when you got a big portfolio, you make a lot of money over a long period of time. That said, um, based on interest rates and, and how these servicing pools look, there's a value. So if the value gets really big on the servicing and the company wants the money, they will sell a pool of mortgages. It doesn't mean we don't love you. It just means it's a business transaction and all companies do this. Mortgage companies need to make money, guys. Um, they, they gotta pay to keep the lights on. So, mortgage servicers, you make your check payable to them. Um, they're, if you wanna do a recast or set up bi-monthly payments or anything like that, you would contact your mortgage servicer. Something to note that you, if you're a husband and wife or two people on the, uh, that own the house together, but both of you aren't on the mortgage or on the note, a mortgage servicer may not talk to the person not on the note. So a lot of times you may have to call the servicer up and give permission and sign some form that allows the non-borrower to actually have that communication. So it's a lot of information coming at you. Uh, at the end of the day, just know pay your bills on time. You can set up auto draft. Typically after closing, you gotta make one or two checks, like write it kind of old school, and then after that set up auto draft, or you can push money to them. But if you guys have any questions, we're certainly here to help. We appreciate you and uh, look forward to talking to you.